Hi everybody. This is the newest addition to the Beakley household. This kitten is just seven days old today. You'll see this kitten's ears aren't quite high on the head. You'll see that this kitten can't even open its eyes yet. He has the tiniest little tail as well. This kitten is in a litter of four. That's what we call when mommy cats have a bunch of kittens at a time, we call them a litter. This little kitten has three brothers. There's one girl and three boys in this family. The mommy's name is Tortilla, like a tortilla chip. And these little guys all have names that have to do with Mexican food. It's kind of fun to foster kittens and you'll see during the upcoming weeks how they grow and how the mommy takes care of them. I'll be videotaping them and YouTubing and you'll see each day how something different happens with these kittens. Right now, the mom is holding her other little kittens underneath her, keeping her warm. It's fun to see this and throughout the day, I'll be showing you some really cool facts about kittens. nice and dark and safe for her. These kittens over here. like mom really loves it back here in this corner with her babies. I'll show you some other things that we are doing for our fosters. Here's where they live uh, during the day and in the evening. This is their little bed and this right here is what keeps them warm when mom is out doing her own thing. This is rice in a bag it's kind of soft, you can feel it like this. We heat it up in the microwave and then we wrap it in a towel and it kind of serves as like a heating blanket, kind of like the chickens have. They love to curl up with this when mom is curled up with us on our laps. This is where the mommy eats. We have fresh water here. This is her bowl for her wet food and then we have some dry food out which we keep all day. Just the mommy eats this, these things right now because the babies are just getting all they need from mom. They didn't just give me these cats. I had to fill out an appli application. I had to show them that I had experience with animals. Thank you to the chickens, the chinchilla, and all my animals here at home. They provide a great experience for us. 
So after they do a check to make sure that you're not gonna hurt the animals, they even called lots of my friends to see what type of person I was. Then they can approve your application. We had to have a safe spot for them to be. We had to have adequate heat and sunlight and a spot where they can be apart from my other animals, Sugar and Izzy. Izzy and Sugar are not happy that these guys are here, but I think they'll get along. They have to be separated for two weeks from Izzy and uh, Sugar. So, oh, here's the mom looking for her baby. She hears her baby crying for her. Here she comes. She's gonna take her back to where the mama wants her. This doesn't hurt the cats at all. They're used to it. She picks them up by the scruff of the neck and takes them back with the other babies so that they can be all nestled together. She heard her baby crying and that's why she came, just like your mom comes when you cry.